Hello guys, in this video, I am going to show you how you can use vision models in LM Studio or in other words, how you can talk with your own images locally on the windows with LLMs by using LM Studio. When we say vision models, what it means is that we give uh, the model an image and then model understand that image and we can talk with that model about that image. That is all there is to it when we say a vision model. For the purpose of this video, I will be using this vision model which is called as Lava 5 3 Mini. We will be installing it in our Windows local system and then I will show you how you can upload your images so that you could talk to them. If you don't know what LM Studio is, it is one of the easiest tool out there which you can use graphically to download, install and then talk with your or use your large language models locally. Not only you can use them locally, but you can just put your LLM on a server, start the server and then with APIs or with um, HTTP methods, you can use that model. There are a lot of other advantages. I have covered LM Studio in great detail in my other videos. Having said that, you can use this same technique on Linux, Windows and Mac, but I will be using it on Windows. If you haven't already downloaded LM Studio from here, just click on it, download the XE, double click on the XE and then next, 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 it will install LM Studio on your local system. This is my local system. I'm running um, Windows here. I have one GPU card of 16 GB VRAM and my memory is 32 GB. You can even run it with 16 GB. So let's type the name of your vision model, whatever vision model you are using. I'm using this latest Lava 5 3 Mini which is the fine-tuned of uh, Microsoft's 5.3 model. Let's press enter. You will see that on the right hand side, there are various quantized version which are already available of this model. So I have already downloaded this GGF file. If you don't have that much space, you can download this int 4.1. But I have the space, so I have gone with F16 one. So you need to download either one of these or if there is any other quantized version available. Another thing which you need to do, especially for the vision model, you need to download the vision adapter too. So in the same window, just search that which file has this tag vision adapter and that file should have mmmproj keyword within it. If you find it, you also need to download this file. Just click on download on the right hand side and it will download it. Then click on this folder icon on the left hand side. You will see the model file is there but you don't see the mmproj file here. In order to make sure that is downloaded, just at the top, click on this show in file explorer. Then this is the Xtuner, which have created this model and this model directory. And you will see mm, sorry, this is what I was saying. I'll just repeat it because it was not shown. So this is Xtuner, this is the model. And then these are the two files in your directory. So make sure both of them are available in this directory. Once they are there, you are good to go. Just click on these three dots on the left hand side. Then on the middle, just click here and load your model. Once the model is loaded, another thing I would highly suggest is that on the right hand side, make sure that you have put in the value max. Just slide it to the right so that all the layers of the model will be loaded to GPU. This will speed up your model a lot. Now, if everything you have followed is there, then you should see this little image icon in your user prompt where you see it here you need to grab any image for example i'm going to grab this komodo image and i will drop it just simply on this image icon and you see that image is there now you can talk about it you can ask what animal is shown in this image let me make it bigger there you go so it is telling you that the image captures a moment of tranquility in nature featuring a brown spiny lizard that is correct basking on a dry grass terrain so it is a komodo dragon by the way you can ask the model is that a komodo dragon it says no it's not a komodo dragon it's a brown spiny lizard okay that is good and you can talk further with with it and then it is going on and on you can see that this is one of the things with Phi 3. It is very, very uh, verbose. So I will just stop it. Otherwise, it will go on and on and on. Let's try out another image. 
in this one i'm just going to do ocr so let's see what is the text in the image okay you see so what is happening i'll stop generating so this is one of the problem either with my gpu card because maybe there is not much space in gpu or maybe lm studio bug but you see instead of answering me correctly model is sort of hallucinating because maybe there is no space in gpu when that happens all you need to do delete the chat i'll just show you i'll just reduce the size delete the chat from the left and then again make sure you drag it all the way to max and then reload your model and then wait for it and then you can chat with it so let's wait for the model to load again you can see model is loaded now grab your image again put it over there and then you can ask it again what is the text in the image keep the answer short let me make it a bit bigger so you see how nicely it has detected the whole text here I'll just stop it you see the quick and it has you know detected the parenthesis it has detected exclamation mark it has even detected this dollar figure to the dot and then you know it has even detected all the special characters which are being used how good is that and then of course it is just going uh you know what exactly in this image and then very honestly it is saying i'm unable to provide a confident interpretation of specific action that would be carried out with this code it think it's a code okay let's try out another image so again let me reload the model just to be sure so let me maybe use this human image let's see describe the image let's see what it does it says the image captures a serene movement between two individuals in a field of wildflowers how good is that yes they are wildflowers the person on the left in a white sweater and the one on the right donning a blue jacket stands shoulder to shoulder and you see the speed is slow because i haven't offloaded all of my all my layers to gpu and if you want to offload it you would need to stop generating and upload it but let's anyway but look at the answer it is still good the sky above is clear devoid of any cloud that is true the positioning of individual relation to field vantage point there is no text or countable objects in the image amazing stuff amazing model anyway i'll stop it but the point is that now you know how you can use images with your vision models locally on your windows system in lm studio if you still having any issues let me know i'll be ha happy to help just share ask them in the comments if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching